Welcome back to another Red Dead Online video. Welcome back to the channel guys. In this video we're going to be talking about how players are still in so much pain since the daily challenge nerf. Yeah it is very painful but yeah let's get straight into the video. I am still receiving comments till this day with players in pain about the daily challenge nerf and also the removal of daily challenge streaks. Now, yeah, I, you know, I get that, you know, I'm still in pain with it, you know, it was something we was used to, nobody likes change and, we, you know, we got to understand at the same time, you know, Rockstar, they are a business, you know, they, they, they have to earn money. They've earned so much money, I'm surprised they did it the way they did. Um, I will say off the bat, you know, straight off the bat, you know, they didn't need to do it the way they did. They could have easily kept daily challenge streaks, um, but just lower the gold, you know, lower the gold. I do think they lowered the gold way too much. You know, we could get 50 gold nuggets per daily challenge. We can now only get 10 in the first week and the most you can get on week four you can only get 25 gold nuggets per daily challenge. That is a massive change. That's like 80% cut on gold. You know, they should have graduated it. Maybe do a 20% cut. Later down the line, do a 50% cut. And maybe leave it at 50% to be honest. But it is what it is. There's nothing we can do. Time has gone on since the nerf. And there's nothing, just, there's nothing we can do. So... And the reason why I'm doing this video is because I still get comments every single day. Like this one, check this one out. This one is one of my subscribers, shout out to you. Uh, they commented, I still haven't played since the daily challenges nerf happened. It will take something big to go back to Red Dead Online for me. Um, that is just one of many comments I still get. And I took this picture literally not long ago, as you can see it says one hour ago. So it's still fresh, you know, people are still angry upset because of the change again we went over the change you know these things happen um but nobody likes change especially the way rockstar made the change the change was massive and again lower the gold i get that you know lower it but don't lower it as much as you have like we're talking like 80 percent cut in gold for daily challenges you know daily challenges are maybe not as worth doing anymore i haven't actually done daily challenges since i've done a few accidental you know just by playing the game but i've not actually gone out of my way to do daily challenges um but since then i may go back to them at some point you know when um the pain does go away i suppose um but yeah you know it's I'm still seeing it today and you know players are hurt and you know new player if you're new and you're watching this now um, and you've not been playing Red Dead Online for long you're probably thinking really are people really acting this way I understand that but you are new you know you haven't been around since beta days and you don't know the routine that we had for daily challenges daily challenges kept people logging in every single day people now don't really have a purpose to log in every single day and people enjoyed logging in every day to do them. I did. I, you know, I had a streak of, what was my streak now? Um, it was, it was just over a year. My streak, yeah, no joke. It was over a year. It was, it was almost four hundred day streak. Um, and and I miss it, of of course. But again, you know, we have to move on from these things. And they could have definitely gone a better way about it. Um, but there are ways of earning gold in the game. Um, you can't earn gold as quick as we used to. But if you would put the grind on, um, there is gold opportunities in the game. And just take advantage, you know, if you, you know, are a full-on gamer and you have every day all day, you can earn a good amount of gold. You definitely can. But people that are very limited to playing the game, you know, full-time jobs, have kids, um, any situation, it is going to be hard for you to really earn some gold. And Rockstar know that, so that's why they do it. They want you to go onto the store and purchase gold, 
we know we know how it works now and it is unfortunate you know rockstar are a great gaming company but they don't think of their fans you know their their community as much as they should they but it's like they see everybody in the world rich there's so many people in the world that's not rich you know people only have enough money to you know buy their shopping look after their kids you know all that good stuff and they don't have change left over to buy gold but they also don't have time to play the game to earn the gold so where does it leave them it is sad when you think about it like that it is sad and rockstar games are not thinking about those players um so what advice do i have take every opportunity you get when gold is on bonus like pvp three times payout on gold whether you like pvp or not just do it because it's gold and you do not have to pay real money for it and there are other gold opportunities that we get in the game you know bounty hunter 50 percent payout on gold and things like that just every tuesday every tuesday i release a, a weekly update video so if you're watching this consider subscribing and tomorrow morning by around 11 a.m uk time i will release a video that i do every single week giving you guys all the information you need to know about a weekly update and you know sometimes they do inc include gold opportunities so definitely consider subscribing guys and let me know your thoughts are you still in pain comment down below how you feel have you still are you still playing the game you know like the comment i just showed you guys that person still hasn't played the game to this day they need they, they're waiting for something big to hit red dead and lion to so they can forget about the daily challenge nerf and get excited for something big coming to red dead and lion is that how you guys feel who's watching this if you are still still playing um, you may be in pain about the daily challenge nerf, but you know you're one of them. You know it is what it is. There's nothing you can do. You've moved on. You're still playing. You know that's kind of me right now. I guess it wasn't when it first happened. I stopped playing, um, but now I'm past it a little bit. You know it's done. There's nothing we can do. Um, is that you? Comment down below. Let me know how you feel about the situation today. Obviously, it's been a little while now, but again. There's so many players in so much pain still to the point they still haven't played it since the Daily Challenge nerf. And that was some time ago now, you know, you think about it, it was quite a while ago. So, yeah, it's crazy, you know, it's crazy to see people people still in pain the way they are right now, you know, and it happened a while ago. It's still fresh, I get that, you know, but it's not coming back, it's not. If anything... It's only going to get worse. It could even get nerfed again in six months' time or more to to five gold nuggets per daily challenge. It, it could happen. It's Rockstar Games at the end of the day. Um, but yeah, you know, it's, it is what it is. You know, the, what can we do? Um, but yeah, again, you know, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts on this topic. And comment down below and let me know if you are still playing. I'm SG. Thank you for clicking on the video and I'll catch you guys next time.